All right, everyone, let's dive in to arrangement view editing. So uh, first of all, welcome to uh, Ableton Live 10 part three, um, coming to you from a very, very, very cold um, Minneapolis, Minnesota. Uh, it is the dead of winter right now, and it is, uh, I don't know, negative 13 or something crazy outside right now. So no better time than to be indoors in the warmth of the studio working on some Ableton Live tracks and um, filming some videos about Live 10. So let's dive in. Now in this section, and I think probably throughout this whole uh, class, the Ableton Live 3 thing that I'm doing here, uh, I'm gonna be using a couple of tracks that are not mine. Um, these tracks are by one of my colleagues at Slam Academy, James Patrick. Um, and when we get started, we're just going to use this one uh, that I have up here now. This is called Capsule Pressure. This is a new track of his that uh, I think he said is going to be released soon, um, probably on his label, which is called The Great Magnet. So keep an eye out for that. Um, and uh, so we're going to pick apart some of these sessions of his and uh, see what he's done and make some changes to them, uh, focus on how we can make some edits and also what he was doing while he was producing it. So we're gonna learn uh, editing and producing in Live 10 using uh, these tracks. So uh, let's dive off, di dive off, let's dive in by just hearing this, this track. It's pretty short, um, about four minutes. Um, this is an arrangement he made of his track. So here are all the pieces over here in session view, but let's just focus on the arrangement view. This is what he sent me. And uh, so let's hear it and then we'll dive into uh, learning live using this session.
Yeah.